Hello and welcome to the Gaming Chronicles. Today we will continue Fantasy Star 3 Generations of Doom. So let's fire it up. Alrighty, in our previous episode we concluded uh, Niles' adventure and with it the uh, entire second generation. So we finished uh, Niles' adventure, we finished Ain's adventure, and now we are going to begin the third generation. So <clears throat> as I had said, we are going to um, let's see. We are going to begin with uh, Aiden. I think that's how you say his name. I've heard it pronounced many times. Let's see. Uh, just the button, right? Yeah, this one. Okay, so uh, we are going to. Go to the end of Niall's quest and pick between Leia and Alair. And, of course, uh, we are going to marry Leia to have the son Aiden. I've heard it pronounced um, Adan, Adan, uh, how else? Of course, Aiden is the way I pronounce it. Um, Adan, Adan. I've heard it pronounced like seven different ways, and I don't even know if there's anyone really knows the right way. So anyway, like I said before many times, we need a pronunciation guide in English. Anyway, we will marry Leia. Niall will marry Leia. So, that's our choice. <clears throat> At last, our people are joined together. Our marriage will, being priest will bring peace to all. Hooray. So, this is very important, and this marriage, I believe that, uh, actually, let's, let's just get past the initial cutscene and then we'll talk. <laughs> we'll talk. <laughs> Alright, Niall and Leia's marriage ended the years of war of hatred, uh, and hatred between the Rakians, yeah, wars and hatred between the Rakians and the Leians. Leia had twins, Aiden, a boy, and Gwyn, a girl. The next 16 years were peaceful and prosperous. Now, this is interesting. Um, in the clue book, it says Niall and Leia have ruled Landon for 18 years. Uh, but Gwyn began to have dreadful nightmares. Every night she dreamt of falling into a dark hole, a pit from which there was no escape. And of course, this is important um, because it alludes to, you know, later on. <clears throat> Fifteen peaceful years passed. And all of a sudden, an earthquake shook the entire kingdom. Aiden, find out what caused the tremor. Uh, sure. Be sure to take Mew and Ren along with you. Aiden, you must take me with you. Now, as we see, Aiden and Gwyn have the signature blonde hair and also the red jewels in their forehead that are a uh, trademark of Leia and being Leian. Uh, so Gwyn joins our party, and I don't remember if she picks up... Does she pick up all of her mom's um, stuff? No, she did not pick up the ceramic bow, which is fine. Uh, she does have force boots. That's nice. Steel fibrilla. Fibrilla. Uh, let's see. She starts at level 1. Aiden, as we see, <clears throat> is quite a strong guy. And, let's see, defense 250. Yeah, Aiden is... I don't know if he's the most powerful of all of the third generation characters. I think he is. Um... He has healing techniques, and I believe, I don't know if it's a toss-up, but uh, he has amazing healing pow prowess. So now we have not one, not two, but three party members right off the bat who have healing abilities. So our, our, our party is pretty set. Uh, and of course he... Uh, 
even though he has the uh, the, the blonde hair uh, of his mother, he has the physical stature of his father, so he's a buff guy. Visit our friend Loon. He may know what's going on. Look at Niall. Look at that. Look at that mustache. You have aged well, King Niall. You might want to just either grow a full beard or shave that mustache. Take off, I don't know, 20 years. <laughs> Take care, kids, and mind your manners, of course. The graceful Queen Leia always remembering to <clears throat> remind our, her children to be good. Let us know what you find out. And of course, uh, Gwyn has the same, exact same sprite. Beware Grim's Grim. Gwyn's dream is a premonition of danger. Uh, exact same sprite as her mother, Leia. Because why not? That's easy programming, yeah? Of course, all of this is. I mean, you have Mew and Ren, they never change. You have, let's see. You know, uh, the MC's sprite is one of two, and Thea is basically just a redesigned, you know, it's the same as Leia, just redesigned a little bit. I think that's it. There's no one else to talk to in here. Um, <clears throat> you have Ryan. Ryan is um, has a unique sprite, I think. Visit Dahlia. Loon may have some answers. All right. I'm trying to think if there's anyone else. Uh, Lena. I think Lena's is unique. So is Sarai. Sa is it Sarai? I say it's Sarai. I don't know if it's Sari, Sarai, whatever. Loon may know something about the earthquake. I'm glad we're such good buddies with Loon now. So we are, of course, uh, yeah, we're in land and we've already established that. What could have caused an earthquake like that? I don't know. And now there is peace. There is no more war between Arakians or Leans. And the whole world, the whole spaceship world of Elisa 3 should be in harmony, right? Right? Yeah? Hurry back to us, Aiden and Gwyn. Okay. Anybody else to talk to? I don't think there is. I... let's see. Anybody else in here? I think by the second generation they've told... Oh, wait, there is somebody up there. I was, gonna, I was about to say. I think they're... Uh, they just got tired of... We'll be safe as long as Niall and Leia are here. I was about to say that they got tired of putting NPCs inside homes and on the top on the top uh, floors of the shops, and so I just I stop. Like, ah, oh, we've done it a couple times in the first and second generation. That's all we need to do. Oh, hey, there's another person up there. So this, ah, this is just so silly. Something shook our Elisa 3 mighty hard. And now everybody knows, of course, because we've diffused the news, that um, we live on a spaceship world, a big giant spaceship. Uh, <clears throat> we know what the truth is. Oh wait, um, yeah, we we know what the truth is. Niles' children know what the truth is. Ain, however, um, does he only knows about Lysa three? He doesn't know about the Leia pendant yet. All right, uh, so where do we need to go? Let's see, we need to go all the way to Dolia. So that means. Um, we need to go to Elysium? Crap, do we need to go... Hold on, where's our monitor? Monitor, monitor. Uh... And as we see, all seven worlds are now... on our monitor instead of just four or three. So Elysium, okay, is to our southwest, yeah? So looking at the map, that means I need to go 
across the bridge. This is Terra. All the way down there. Oh, okay. That's a long ways. Wait. Um. Yeah, I think that's the way we need to go. Oh, an encounter. What's this? There are cyborgs and monsters attacking me? Oh yeah, that's right. Rin still has the ceramic shop because we were too lazy to grind out the gear for um, anybody. Ooh, that's a hard hit. Okay, so Gwen's gonna level up a little fast at the beginning. It's important that we keep her alive. <clears throat> all right. Oh boy, we've got an all all kinds of a combination of of monsters. All right, uh, let's go ahead and just cast Gyrus. Oh, we should have visited the technique shop. Oh well, it's fine. Oh, hello. I think uh, there's a chance of um. I think there's a chance of meeting all monsters from all generations, all cyborgs from all, uh, from all generations in in your uh, in the third and last generation. So the question is, if the Leyans and Arakians are at peace, who is sending the monsters after us? Hmm. Alright, let's go ahead and kind of drain Gwyn's um, M uh, TP. That way, if we come across any encounters that we surprise the monsters, we can uh, do a glitch win. See, so yeah, definitely worth it that we got Muse, Laconian Claws, and the uh, Laconian sword for Aiden. Uh, hello. Get him. Nice. <laughs> okay. And let's see. I think I'm going the right way. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We're, we're fine. Oh, a green lizard. All right. Okay, and I figured we would be okay not to upgrade Ren's weapon at this point. Uh, because really, we need all the money that we can get. The armor, the endgame armor is so expensive, holy smoke. You want to think about how much the armor costs. Okay, we have to go past the airstrip and into the temple since now we can use that. There we go. Let's go ahead and use a uh, quick gyros from Gwyn just to use up some ATP, TP. Bum, 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 bum. Alright, and we should be in Elysium now. Keyword is should. Uh, where are we? 
I'm looking at the Elysium map, and I am not... Wait. No, actually, I'm not. I'm not looking at the Elysium map. Now I'm looking at my Elysium map. Wrong page. So... Hmm... Now we have to go through Divizio. This is a bit of a walking. A bit of walkie walkie walkie. Oh good, poison. Nice. Got him! Yeah! Hello, sir. Welcome to Northern Divisio. Well, thank you. Uh, let's go to a technique shop. Let's see if there's anybody home in this spacious house. Nope, just another random empty house. So all right, whatever. Um, we got an item shop and a church. Enter the castle to reach Southern Divisia. A pilot lives beyond the bay past our town. Oh, okay. Um... I need ah okay so I need Divisia Castle just want to make sure that I don't Do we have to go through the dungeon I think we have to go through the dungeon Ugh, I'm looking at all the places that we can go <laughs> yeah we have to go through the dungeon Dang it! Uh, are there monsters in here? There shouldn't be, right? Um, crud, how do we, uh... I don't remember how to get through. Uh, this is embarrassing that I don't remember how to get through this guy. I mean, granted, it's not... Let's see, can we just go to that over there, and then go all the way up there. Oh, it's, it's still a long walk in the dungeon. Okay, so we can just, like, go, oopsies, not... Is there actually anyone here to talk to? Nope. Is there anybody in the castle? Is there, you know, even the... Oh, okay, there's people in the courtyard, at least. Real pilots are almost non-existent nowadays. My knowledge has been lost since they left us. Not to worry, though. Rulikur is still around. Who is Rulikur? Glorious to visit town, strangers. Did you know that Ren cyborgs can transform? You must find the parts to fly, swim, and dive. Well, how nice. Our ancestors piloted this spaceship long ago, but over the years, much knowledge has been lost. Yep, that's much as obvious. All right, let's uh, take the long walk around the dungeon. Okay, and it appears that this dungeon is safe. Fantastic. So we're gonna walk thousand miles just to get to where we need to go this is unnecessary couldn't like the Divizia castle just like I don't know knock down a wall to uh, do a little bit of remodeling so that I could pass through the castle without having to march through the dungeon. And I'm not even getting any battles to get any experience. It just 
I'm walking through the town and the dungeon. All right. But this is the last time that we will have to walk through Divizia Castle, at least, well, the only time in, in Aiden's adventure. Uh, let's see. Let's talk to people. Our people piloted this great spaceship. Aaron is rumored to have pilots even now. Some rebels are in a cave far to the west. The subparts for Ren are also in that cave. Oh, so you say the same thing. Use these to find latest treasures in Iridia. Okay, so you say the same thing as in from Generation 2. To reach Aaron, you need Leia's pendant. Yeah, well, we got it. I wonder if they say these same things for the sake of... Hey, where's the technique shop? Did I miss it? I don't think that I did. Item shop. In. Random empty house, I'm sure. That nobody lives in or is occupying. Yeah. Called it. Okay, surely there is a technique shop. I must have just missed it. Overlooked it uh, in North Divisia. Yeah, because this one's. This is another empty house. Yep. <clears throat> okay. Um, so, we've heard all this stuff that's important, right? We've heard about Rulakir, the parts for Ren, um, to swim, fly, and dive. That, that's really the most important thing about um, the conversations that we've had in these towns. <clears throat> uh, and now we need to go to Aron, which we can do now. Uh, let's see. We need to just walk around the mountains here. And then there's a Leyen Temple that will take us right to it. Oopsies. Having some problems with the D-pad. Ah, these are all from the second generation still. All right. Oh, hello, we got new enemies. Zarachnes. Oh, their gra is fairly effective. At least for now, right? Nice, and that is why we bought a Laconian sword for Nile. And for Ain, but yeah, that Laconian sword and the Laconian claws that Mew has. Very important for Um carrying us through the first parts of the third generation. Alrighty, and now we are at Arone. Hooray! The last home of the pilots. Each on this path leads to the Moon Dahlia. Alright. A dream in which you fall into a dark pit? We've heard we are aimed toward a black hole. Perhaps your dream is a warning of our fate. Oh. Well, that's not good. What's a black hole? The denizens, like, we, we certainly wouldn't know from the perspective of our party. Probably, anyway. Okay, where is the technique shot? Let's see, how much money do we have? We got 22,000. That's not very much. Uh, what can I buy with 22,000? Anything at all. 
Um... <clears throat> I mean, I think I'll be okay for the time being. Uh, I don't know. Let's let's go to the technique shop and let's redistribute our uh, technique points. Um, Gwyn. Uh, we probably want to have her be our anti and river. There we go. And then Mew. Uh, we'll keep you on res duty. Okay, yeah, that's good. Let's check, uh, make sure that Ren. We'll keep Ren um, on two. <clears throat> Aiden on heal. All right, yeah, well, you'll be the 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 Gyrez caster. Gyrez, Gyrez, whatever it is, Gyrez. Wow, that's a massive healing. That's a massive just uh tech. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Technique Square. And Aaron, um, the other son of Nile, the alternate son of Nile, is the same way. Huge. Um, a huge healing square. That's why I say I think they're about equal as far as healing power. That explosion knocked us off course. Maybe your dream means that there's a black hole ahead. So the people of Arone say it's an explosion. We think it's an earthquake. So, and it's interesting how, depending on which generation you play, gives you a different perspective, right, of what actually happens. Uh, like, uh, for Aiden, we start out in Landon, and to us, we perceive that it's an earthquake, when really, it's actually something else, which will... I think the loon tells us what it is. I can't remember. Honestly. Okay, let's go... to the dungeon... And off we go, up into space. Back to Dahlia. <clears throat> Hello, Loon. It's just me. I'm sure you saw me coming. I think that he's in the um, upstairs part now. Yep, yeah, there we are. Perhaps the wise folk of Skyhaven on Frigidia know why the spaceships attacked one another. Hmm. Aero parts for Ren can be found in our dungeon. So, this uh, guard mentions the spaceships attacking one another. And so as Aiden, we're totally clueless of what's going on. Aero parts for Ren can be found. Okay, yep. So, we need to get to the dungeon. I saw a spaceship that looked exactly like ours. But both spaceships beamed lasers at each other, and the strange spaceship exploded! The earthquake happened when our ship was hit and was knocked off its set course. Do we ever learn what its actual set course was? And here is a lair. A long time ago, your father rescued me. I'm sure you can protect my niece, Kara. Once again, evil stalks our world, Aiden. I am sending Kara to accompany your group. She has my Loon Slicer. I think you'll need it. Okay. Hello, Kara. Father wants me to accompany your party. It is my duty to find out what happened. Kara joins your party. Alright. And Kara also has healing techniques. <laughs> so we have four, no less than four healers. 
And our party is essentially the same also if, uh, Leia, um, joins, uh, the, like, if it's instead of Gwen, it's Leia. Um, but we'll get to that when we're in Aaron. But anyway, so this Kara is also a very strong healer. Um, man, she's got bad gear. Ugh. Yeah, that's bad gear. All right. So now, uh, we can get to the other part of the dungeon that I, I had thought for some reason that we could have got to. Uh, a Megatoad. Oh, goodness. Now, Gwyn has less than 5 MP, so anytime we surprise a monster, uh, we can basically insta-win. Uh, which I will do in the interest of time, of course. Um... Uh, 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 just because, you know, combat isn't really terribly exciting. I forgot to heal Kara. If she gets attacked, she will die. Alright, that's ceramic shot. It's okay. There's... Uh, there's no point, really, at this, uh... Right now. Let's, no, not, uh, technique. Kara. Let's go ahead and throw a Gires out. Does anybody have a healing item? Uh, no. Whatever. Poison, oh my goodness. Get him. There we go. Now this is a pretty big basement, so we'll be walking a little... We'll be walking a ways. Oh, did I... I wasn't paying attention to our party order. I need to make sure that Ren is walking in front of Mew. All four of them are nice. Uh, nope. Okay, let's switch it out. Aiden first, Ren second, then... Uh, I think Mew, then Gwyn, then Kara. Yeah. Just, just Ren and Mew need to be switched up. Okay, so... Oh, I need to... Pull up the dungeon. Dahlia dungeon. Okay. Let's walk over this way first. Oh, we surprised the monster. We could have won. Ah, that's alright. It's alright. Okay, there should be a chest coming up soon, yeah. <clears throat> Ooh, Mew needs a heal. Nice. Alright, let's uh, cast anti- oh, oh, we can't, dang it. Eh, come on. <clears throat> yeah, his guy is already 21. That's pretty nice. I think it gets up to... T Whoa, does it 25? 26? 29? I don't remember. Item. Aiden. We will eventually switch who is the, uh, the Gerez, um... We'll switch it to Kara, or Gwyn, eventually. Uh, once we, you know, they're leveled up a little bit better. Iconium Bandana. 
Can anybody even wear that? I don't think so. Um... Because you can't equip it, right? Not that you want to. You have a Laconian Helm. Uh... Kara? I don't... I don't know. Oh, yeah. It's, it is you. Okay. Conium Bandana. Okay. So now I think I need to go... Down, right? Down. No. I think I have to go back up the top and then around yeah I have to circumvent on the edge uh, yeah we have to go all the way out here oh hello Ambushed. Rude. All right. Uh, the encounter RNG has been lovely today. There we go. Wow, six Meseta, really? And their experience isn't even very good. Okay, do we go up or down? Oh, we could have. Uh, whatever. Is it here? Ah, no, we have to go this way. Man, my map reading skills today are not the best. We didn't actually have to go all the way up and around like we just did. I'll just say that. For starters. That's fine, it's fine. Uh, there's this chest, uh, there's, there's two more chests, oh, hello. These are all second generations, or first generations, so. Ren can still make quick work of those guys, nice. And this should be, yeah. Crown. And we need to take the bottom. Yep, we need to take the bottom. Oh, hello. Ambush, really. <laughs> Come on. Leave me alone. It'd be nice if there were more Vulcan type weapons in the game that hit an entire row, but alas, they're on. Ah, we went the wrong way. Come on now. Go up and. Uh, what's the right. Oh, we have to keep going at the bottom. Man, come on. Learn to read a map. Lobo Hawk. Whoa.
Wow, that was a good experience. Okay, is it this one? Yes, okay, man. Struggling. Ambush, no. Oh. Rary. Wait, so the mega is the mega Toad to second generation because it really was not giving us good experience. Um, arrow apart, terrain. All right, let's uh, go ahead and just give the Ren parts to Ren. Not that he needs them, but just I like to organize my inventory that way. Oh, hello. Okay. Maybe we should just run away from those battles. They're kind of a waste of time. I mean, I know what I said at the very beginning that a battle is a battle, experience is experience, and Meseta is Meseta. Okay, like this battle is worthless. Um, very little experience in Meseta. Okay, now we have to walk all the way back around. Okay, this one will be fine because. Oh, uh, Karen Gwyn need heals. Yeah, people need heals. Hmm. I haven't been paying attention to my party very much, have I? No, I've just been... I've been looking at this map. <laughs> Believe it or not, I have been looking at the map. And uh, my map reading is... Uh, left a lot to be desired. There we go. Okay, let's go party. Why is Kara wearing a dress? Uh, yeah, let's take this battle. Uh, we'll just run away from any non, any any battles that don't have any third generations in them. Nice. That was three. And up and around we go. Up and around we go. Oh, ambushed. Who would have thunk? Alright. Does anybody need a heal? We'll do that. <coughs> Does Aiden have... You do have the coating armor. Okay, good. Thought so. Ambushed! Yay! Uh, once we get back to our own, we'll save and call the episode. A lot of walking, but we got some very important things accomplished. We got our arrow parts for Ren. Uh, which will save us gobs of time uh, in this uh, in this generation, <clears throat> and of course it allows us to go to places we couldn't have gone before, like Skyhaven in Frigidia, <clears throat> which will be our next destination, of course. Nice. Okay, so now we'll... See, we could have taken that little cut right there. It's fine. Uh, oh yeah, we'll just... Well, maybe. Uh, that didn't really save us much time, did it? Oh well, it's free battle. Free 400 experience, even though that's a, a drop of water. I think that might have been the first time we actually surprised monsters in this uh, in the dungeon here
There we go. Aiden gained a level. Nice. Uh, did we surprise the monster? I was looking at my map. Nope, we did not surprise the monster. You can always do that to check. Be like, oh, did I, did I surprise him or not? Just always try that. Get him. Oh, ambushed, all right. It's a really good thing we have so much healing power. And one thing I will say, uh, this goes back to Ren, right? Why we didn't gear Ren up more, why, why we only geared Mew up halfway. Uh, so, Niall's children, the, both of their parties start out with, I, th I think, way more healing power than uh, than either of Ain's children, which seems ironic, right? Because Ain is the is the one who has really OP healing for second generation, and um, uh, we could have auto won that. That's okay. Um, and I think both his children, Sean and Chris. Are the are the weaker of uh, you know the, they're the weaker casters, but uh, Niall's children, um, Aiden, Aaron, and of course, um, and of course Gwyn, they all have very strong magic. Okay, uh, we up, we need to go up one more. In fact, I don't think Chris. Can even cast healing techniques. Uh, do you have anything different to say? Nope. Now that I have the uh, Ren parts, nobody cares. So I have two of the red legendary weapons now. Uh, both of them are weak, comparatively, right? The Loon's Slicer and the Leia's bow are, I believe, the weakest weapons in their respective categories. I mean, against second generation monsters and lower, they do just fine, right? Uh, the slicer can take care of anything second generation or lower, but, um, well, most, well, some of second generation. Never mind. I'm thinking about there. There are some second generation that her slicer doesn't do well. Oh, there are monsters down here. Oh, hello. Oh crap! They hit hard. And these are cyborgs. Wow. Yeah, that was a hard hit. 33 damage. Dang. I mean, I could fight down here, but I wouldn't probably get any uh, any Meseta. Dang! All right, let's go ahead and rest at the inn, and then our next episode will take us to the world of Frigidia, I believe. All right, where's that inn? Did we talk to you? Yep. Yep, we did. Oh, so we will overwrite. Look at that difference. Nile was level 16, Ain was level 20 when we ended their quests. Um, I guess we'll save over Nile's position, right? Um, since it's Nile's kid. Uh, yeah, that's okay. Alrighty. So until our next episode, when we continue on our journey to find out why the uh, the Elisa 3 spaceship and another spaceship were attacking each other. We will unravel the mystery soon. So, until our next episode, so long for now. <laughs>